Hey guys, and welcome to a new video. Today I'm gonna show you how to make Tex clone diaper, knee pads, and hair shin guards. This is a very easy video since everything is pretty straightforward. The only thing that is pretty difficult is the knees, and these took me five minutes each. It's just making the templates for these were very hard, trying to make it curve. But before we get into the video, and I have one message. And that is to subscribe. Subscribing greatly motivates me to keep putting out great videos. But my next video, I'm hopefully going to be making Tech's belt with his holsters and his tools. So look out for that video. I'm still waiting on a few of the supplies, but that should be out within the next week. So I'm super happy how this turned out. Now let's get into the build process. Okay, so right now I have some of the pieces cut out that I need for the finished clone belt or tech belt. So this is the front of it. Under, in this wedge, that piece is going to fit in. And this piece is going to be curved up, put in there. And then the back, or all these darts are going to be have to be glued together. And same on the back, it's just curve it up and glue all the darts together. So let's get right into that. Okay, guys, so I basically did exactly what I was going to say. But instead of curving up the darts, nothing would work. So I cut it in half and then added another piece of cardboard below it. That would make the belt have a curve down. So when that is done, you're going to want to cover up some of the corrugation that there was. And then on the back, again, some of the darts wouldn't work. Sometimes they'll work for you, but they wouldn't work for me. So I just cut it off and gave it a nice contour shape. Um, shape then I add or closed one side of the belt completely closed and then added a buckle to one side And that's how you take it on and off clip the buckle closed and you have the complete belt So this is time for the shin. I'm only showing you how to make one so There's the base shape and then you can um extend this little shape that makes it fit your leg more that will be included in the templates the one that I use but yours might have to be bigger or smaller, depending on which one. And then the knees, it's just gluing up all the seams and making sure everything lines up. You see on this one, you have to curve it together, and that's what gives it the nice bowl shape. Thank you for watching to the end of how I made Tex's legs, which include the clone diaper, his shins, and his knees. So if you liked the video, make sure you go down below and leave a like. Subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any future videos including Tech's belt and finishing up all of Tech's armor, which painting, and then making Echo and Crosshair's armor. So that is all for today, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.